a reading of the New Testament as rendered by the Gullah people of uh, South Carolina, my peoples on uh, my mother's side. And what we do is uh, we just pick any place, slip it there. Luke, we like Luke. Uh, well, I mean, I didn't know him personally, but, you know, they said he was a doctor. Plus, the reason why I like Luke is because Luke they supposedly wrote Acts. And Acts, you know, of course, they said no more Acts, but Acts continue to this day. This might be an act right here. Uh, in fact, this act is based on uh, the uh, the King James Version of the Holy Bible. And uh, so in the Gullah Bible, this is the Gullah Bible. You have the King James Version here, small font, and then the uh, Gullah over here in a little larger font. Because of those fonts, I have to put on my um, reading glasses. And what we do is just pick out any place like I just did. Uh, we're going to page, page uh, uh, well, 240, 246. Let's go 246. Let's go 246. Nine, I suppose. And we read. I done tell on a ask God and I'm going to get yeah, what you asked for. Look to God and you're going to find What's up? What's gonna be? Yeah, the look for knock to God door and he gonna open them to you. And the translation is, and I say unto you, ask and it shall be given you. Seek and ye shall find. Knock and it shall be opened. Uh, uh the reason why we, by the way, I'm gonna, we read it twice. So the reason why we read it is because this is a like it says the Gullah people, they're the newly freed people, and well, people newly freed are during the, you know, slavery time uh, in the United States of North America. Uh, they quickly learn how to read and write. And the reason, I, I suppose, well, the reason was, the, well, I don't know what to read. Well, the reason was because the only book they had was the Holy Bible. And so, um, so I've, I've been reading it just to, just to feel how they felt. I'm trying to well, you know, I'm trying to get in touch with my roots, I suppose. So we read it twice. Here it is again. Uh, Luke 11. 9. And until I want to say, ask God and he going to get you get your what you ask for. Look to God and you're going to find uh, what's going to be you the look for. Knock to God's door and he going to open um to you. And the translation uh, from the King James Version, you know, this is, in fact, this is the King James Version is like the Christopher Marlowe Shakespeare language right there. And I say unto you, ask and it shall be given you. Seek and ye shall find. Knock and it shall be open to you. Reading uh, from my people's, uh, my being me, T from the Pattersons, taking the train to Tibet, letting you know what I only suspect from the Gullah Bible.